Okay, we are now going to go to the RC tab. This is the tab where you would use to select your servo types and the type of connection that you're using to the Cortex. As you see here, there's an analog and digital selection. If you're using digital servos, you can go ahead and choose the digital setting and the Cortex will perform a little bit better and it'll drive the servos a little bit more efficiently. If you're using analog servos, do not use a digital setting. It can cause damage to analog servos. Now, if you're moving the Cortex between planes and say you have a plane that has analog servos and one plane that has digital servos and you're doing this out at the field, it's best just to leave it on analog servos because analog setting will drive and use digital servos perfectly fine. It's just not as efficient and as high performance as you possibly can get if you had it in the digital setting. The next thing down here we have the cable loom, PPM Spectrum JR SAT S bus. This is the connection type that the Cortex is using to your radio. I did a video already on how to set up the JR Spectrum SATs, so if you need to learn how to do that, just search for my videos and you'll find that one. You have PPM and then you have S bus. I'm going to go ahead and do the cable loom here and cover that. But if you change this to PPM, JR Spectrum SAT, or S bus, you have to come down here and make sure that your channel assignments match the channels that are in your radio. I believe these are Futaba channel assignments. I know for JR and Spectrum, we have to come in here and change a few of these so it match correctly in your radio. Again, if you want to learn how to do that, just search my other video and that will be covered there. Again, we have the load button here. We have the reset button to factory defaults. We have the read RC and then the write. All equal signs are green, telling me that this is uh, factory default and everything on this page equals what's in the cortex. So say I want to come in here. I know I'm going to put in a plane that has digital servos. I simply click it. Now I can see here I have a red equal sign with a line through it. This is not a factory default setting. And this is also red with a line through it, telling me that the changes I made here have not been written to the cortex yet. So hit write all here. And now we have a green equal sign here, but this remains red due to the fact that it's not a factory default setting. So I'm going to go ahead and reset this back to factory default, write all. And then we're going to move on to the next tab in the next video, which is the Diagnose tab.